I've always had something against mobile apps. It's nothing specific, I just feel like there's no depth to them. I feel like I can't play them for more than a few minutes without being bored and wanting to do something else. That's why PC gaming has always been a holy grail for me. Console gaming has also been something that I'd done in the past, but I kind of moved on from it. But mobile gaming is something that I really do not like. So if you're a mobile gamer, that's great. But unfortunately, this is not going to be the video for you, as I doubt I'm going to be liking this very much. Now, I don't think you'll be able to hear the audio of this, because the screen recorder I've been using, I've been looking through loads, it's been so hard to get this thing done, and uh, I don't think it actually records the audio of the game. But, nevertheless, we shall get into it. Now, this is Steel and Flesh, and as you can probably tell by the name, this is a Mountain Blade clone, a mobile Mountain Blade clone. Yes, and it's going to be terrible, and I'm excited. Looking at the screenshots, it looks like this can probably be one of the worst Mountain Blade clones I've ever seen. You may see there's actually a Roman there, but uh, don't let that deter you from thinking this is some sort of an original matter. Adverts. Literally, one of the main reasons I hate mobile games is adverts. So, uh, oh, there's a stolen piece of artwork there. How nice. Yeah, I'm not going to be very nice to this game. Apologies. If uh, you guys want me to be nice, I'm, I'm not. I'm going to say what I actually think about this game. I'm going to give it a chance, but uh, I'm going to go... <laughs> with what I can actually see. So my name is going to be Sir Micro Mi Micro Transaction. There we go. My name is Sir Micro Transaction. Lovely. My player clan is going to be Corporate uh, dou Douche Bags. There we go. Beautiful. So uh <laughs> It's going to be interesting. So you can actually play as quite a few different guys on this. Um, you've got Russia, Ottomans, France, England, Germany, Poland, Vikings, Romans, you know, all the normal ones like Empire Song and Golden Horde. Golden Horde sounds a little bit like a porno. Oh dear me. And also stuff like the Pirates, Rebels and Bandits. Now the difficulty levels is very low, low, middle. Middle? That's a bit of a weird one. High and uh, very height. I don't know if this was a foreign developer, but I don't think they could speak English very well. But we're going to go with middle, and uh, let's praise the Roman Empire, because Romans are awesome. Maybe they're going to be awesome in this. And if you haven't been convinced that this is very Mountain Blady, clone-esque type, if you think, hey, it's just a coincidence that it's called Steel and Flesh, let's zoom out on this map a, a tad bit. Where, I've, where have I seen this kind of map where you have all the, the city places and you have your, you know, your inventory, your play, your clans and your quests and stuff down at the bottom? Where have I seen that kind of thing before? Oh, oh look at this. Oh, oh, I'll just get rid of that screen recorder. That's another screen recorder I was using. That's interesting. I see, I see, I see. So, uh, what, what do we do? Let's... Let's, let's go to Rome. Rome is a good place to start, I'd say. So let's uh, go there. Have a bit of a, a gander over here. We can recruit some soldiers. Okay, no one wants to see the tavern. Okay, they haven't... Okay, we can actually recruit people from the tavern. Now, if you can hear the audio, then you can probably hear that. If you can't, that is the exact same recruiting sound as Mountain Blade. Yes. It plays the exact same sound that I think they blatantly just copied off. Oh, we can get some swordsmen there. Might as well. Um... Is it um, okay. So these are our knight archers, which look like to be some shoddy Roman auxiliary archers on top of horses that don't look like they were able to ride. Dear me. Uh, who do we have? Okay, no. No, that's... That's not even... What is that horse armor? We might as well get him anyway. Okay, here's... What? What? No, no. This is an archer. R this is a, a Roman archer wearing some type of strangely, <laughs> strangely made Lorica Segmentata that's got a lot of patterns and nice stuff on it. It looks cool, but unfortunately, just no. Okay, I'm completely out of money. But uh, we can probably go to war now. We've got 20 men. Let's see if we can find anyone to beat up. Maybe some bandits somewhere. I don't know. Are there bandits in this? Because we're going to have to find out. Um, yeah, my main problem with mobile games is the amount of adverts on it. And not just that, the fact that the adverts aren't even slightly related to the game that it's advertising. Um, I'm sure you guys have seen a lot of that. I'm going to be making a video on that since I've been collecting a lot of evidence for that. And 
I think it needs to be said because um, it's kind of getting a bit insane. You might see in this if an advert pops up. Sometimes there's probably going to be like a game called like Crusader Knight Falcon Shoot Sword thing with uh, Napoleon Total War footage playing in the background, which is always interesting to see. Is there, is there no one around? Absolutely. Oh my word, that draw distance. It's interesting. Hello? Anybody home? Nobody? Should we... Oh, here we have someone. That's a, t a group of 29 people just went into Constantinople. Oh, here we have 14. Right, we can take these step bandits out. Okay, let's try and take these step bandits out. Are we... Is there ship battles in this? Are we gonna be... Okay. That was strange. Attack! Um, fight! I mean, excited to see how this works. Fight! Here we go, lads. We're going into our first battle. And uh, then we have Arnold Schwarzenegger, or a very pixelated version of him in the Hello Mobile Strike. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, stupid. If you have possessions, any clan can declare any war on you. Oh! We have a ship battle! Okay. Um, do my men just charge in? Okay, I guess they do. Oh my word, what is the frames on this? Oh dear. Oh my word. Let's see if we can get around the back. <laughs> what is this game? Aha! Kill the archers. And. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. You'll think that I'm saying no because that. I just died. But this. Oh, the sound I made when I die is the exact same sound as a Mountain Blade dying sound. I kid you not, I know that I don't have any proof for this at the moment, but if I find a way of showing you guys... Oh my god, they've literally copied all the sounds from the game. And of course we have another advert here. Of course it's forcing you to watch an advert, why wouldn't it? Thanks for that mate, thanks a lot. And now I'm dead. Are my men fighting it out? Oh yeah, they are slightly laggily, but they're still fighting. Oh, some cool animations there actually. Yep. All these sounds, the bow sounds, screaming sounds from Mountain Blade Warband. Um, we can go between different people. I, I don't believe this. The slicing sounds, everything is from Mountain Blade. I. I'm actually genuinely gonna have to report this to Tail Worlds. Um, yeah. This, this has ended up, this started with making a video just making fun of a mobile game, but I'm going to have to report this to Tail Wars because this is what you call, children, plagiarism. You can't just use the sounds of another game to put in your mobile game. You can't do that. I mean, unless they've had permission, I don't care about this stupid game. But, you can't just, I'm actually triggered now. I don't get triggered very often. But when a game is trying to clone Mountain Blade Warband, one of my favourite games ever made, using all the same sounds, everything there, it, it is, um, yeah. Anyway, bandits declare war back, war back? <laughs> declares war on corporate douchebags. It's interesting. Oh, we've got some gear here. Let's take all. Might as well. Let's see if we can sell that stuff. So, um, what I'm going to do quickly is after. Right now, actually, I'm going to film this from my camera, my actual camera. So you'll be seeing it. It'll be bad quality. You won't be able to see what's going on the screen. But you're going to be able to hear everything, and that's what's important. You're going to be able to hear exactly what I mean about Mountain Blade sounds. Um, I'm going to quickly just just leave this here and uh, show you what I'm talking about. Right, now, this is going to be terrible audio quality, terrible pretty much everything, but it's only so you can hear the audio coming out of this phone. So, uh, let me quickly see if I can turn this music off, because it's horrendous. Um, I guess there is not a music button. So if we can go to menu, so we can turn... This is... That was Empire Total War. Well done, you've... Uh tended to be in another game. Right, can we turn the music off? There we go, right. Let's turn up the generic volume so I can show this to you guys. So let's continue game. And uh, <laughs> I'm gonna... <laughs> oh, you're gonna love this, guys. It's actually probably gonna be backwards for you, maybe. I don't know, maybe we'll see. 
Yes, I want to continue a new game. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Can you hear that? Hear those sounds? Gun sounds. They're the sounds from Mountain Blade Napoleonic Wars, if you didn't know. You're welcome. Anyway, that was just an advert. I just I just noticed that then. Um, but let's uh, get into a microtransaction. Yeah, I'm on 14 men, lads. Yeah, it's going good. Right, so let's see if I can get into battle. It doesn't really matter who with. Um, right, let's see if anyone else wants to have a bit of a tussle. Because I actually, let's see if I can show you the recruiting noise, okay? Recruit soldiers. Okay, listen to this. Listen to this. It's just... Hmm. Very, very similar. I mean, listening to it now, actually, from this, it doesn't sound as identical as it did with my earphones on. But uh, I, I, I still wouldn't say there's much difference in it. But when you get into battle and you actually hear what happens when the men die, that is when the real fun starts to happen. Come on, come back, Tacitus. Wait, what is he doing with an army? I'm pretty sure he was a writer. Right, let's attack these lads. And let's fight. Yep, 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 whatever. Let's fight. Okay, more Empire Total War. Just as a... Uh, yep, yep. Okay, you're being loud and obnoxious. That's another stolen picture there. And, okay. So, listen to the sounds, okay? Just listen. That's all I want you to do. Listen. Listen to them. Yep, that is uh, the sounds of this game, or in other words, Mountain Blade Warband. Okay, I'm going to have to watch a bloody advert before I can show you guys any more of that sound, but um, I'm going to try and hold the phone back up to the microphone actually very quickly. I mean, there's a few different ones mixed in there. But anyway, yeah, so this is Steel and Flesh, a complete rip-off and clone of Mountain Blade Warband on mobile devices. Do not go and download this. Thank you for whoever notified me of my last video saying, hey, go and get this game. It's going to be exciting. You might be able to play it. It's like Mountain Blade, but on mobiles. And uh, you are a mean person. I did not want to play this. I was interested, but uh, it was... <laughs> Yeah, maybe it was worth it if we can get this game taken down now because it's clearly just ripped off everything from Mountain Blade. But uh, yeah, thank you for whoever suggested that and I, I have a lot against mobile games. I apologise if you do like it, that's more power to you, but me personally I hate mobile games. Don't download this game. Go and download a mobile game that has actually some original content on it. And uh, actually, go and download a good mobile game like... Um,